What's up guys, welcome back to a new video on Football Stuff TV where today we're going to be opening this game pack for the Cricket Attacks 122022 trading card collection. Four limited edition inside, um, which is fantastic. That's a hell of a lot of limited editions. Um, and as you can see, you also get 40 cards, um, 16 page collector guide and an A2 mat. Didn't get this last year, haven't watched any videos of this last year, so I don't know what uh, uh, you know this game pack looks like from the inside. So really excited to see. And there you go, as you know, with this new collection, some of the special cards have, uh, you know, a scan card on the back, which uh, if I get one, I would love to try, but I'm, uh, I'm yet to get any of these, uh, yet to get any of those cards, considering I've only opened a, uh, a few packets. So, before you get everything out, oh, look at that, very, very nice looking. So, there's the game pack, looking nice and empty. And here's the stuff you need. I mean, it's really disappointing. Personally, they don't do a core. Cool, that is four limited edition cards inside, and that is that thick. Maybe it's just a standard pack. Oh, it is 10 cards. There you go. Anyway, the only thing I find disappointing about this collection, um, and the only thing really, is that you can't just go and buy the uh, binder in shops. You have to go on Top's website, order it. It's just a binder on its own. You have to pay that delivery fee just to get it. So I'm going to wait and order it once I've you know, got other stuff I want to order. But nonetheless, here you go. Here's your sort of map. Sorry, I can't fit it all in the screen. I'll do a little scan of the whole thing. So it's got all the teams at the top there. And there you go, a bit of the scoreboard and stuff there. Something that I'll just be, you know, uh, keeping sort of, you know, unused for the, uh, for the collection. We then very quickly have this 100 collector guide. Won't spend too long on it, but obviously, as in we get it with every Tops and Panini collection, how to play. The get to know your cards, we'd love to get one of these Centurions, especially that Ben Stokes one, that looks a fantastic card to get. Um, then obviously uh, some future legends, which are new, new signings. And the there's a the checklist, really, really nice looking checklist, a lot bigger than last year's collection. A lot better, in my opinion, than last year's collection with a load of uh, limited editions, including these new uh, sort of, you know, Platinum Red Ultra um, variants, which are, you know, slightly on the difficult side to get. Um, so it'd be nice to get that. And then here's the fixture list, which is a really nice little touch, I think, personally. So if we move this all to the side... And we get the free packets. We'll do the typical YouTube fashion of doing the limited edition pack last. And we'll get on to these free packets uh, straight away. So here we go. Because I've only done one of these videos, just a quick look, you know, here for you to see the uh, uh, odds on what you can get. But I won't go through that all today. So can we get something like 100 pack? Maybe even a limited edition if we're lucky in just one of these packs as well. That would be pretty cool. So, Captain Fantastic, Lewis Gregory. I'll try not to spend too long on the base cards, because um, I know they're not the most exciting, but there you go. Craig Overton, Super Booster. Uh, Tyler Bell. Uh, then we have Grace Gibbs. Holly Armitage. And then we have Tammy Beaumont. Another Captain Fantastic card, Sarah Glenn. And then our Shinies, which are Birmingham Phoenix Logo. So really nice. We'll start making the uh, you know, little pile for each sort of section. And a hit for six, Alex Hales. Really nice. 88 batting. Um, just got to remember which ones those are. So these are just the cards we've got to look out for if we want to do any of the scans. Just trying to quickly familiarise myself with the names. I'm sure I'll forget. I'm sure I will. Then we have this. Here we go. So... Value-wise, I don't think this is actually fantastic. Six packs costs um, six pounds. I mean, you're paying quite a lot for a game mat and collector guide, but I suppose the four limited editions are what really gives this sort of game pack its um, value. Anyway, we have Milan, uh, Garton, uh, Davies, uh, Super Booster Howe. It gets confusing because then they suddenly go to the other side, the names, and I'm looking for it. Then we have Cap. Uh, oh, here you go, Volvart. Sorry, the camera just unfocused there. Georgia Hennessy, uh, Alana King, and then our shinies with another badge. 
Look at that. Started off with two Houston Rockets on the base, clearly, and then we've got a Houston Rocket badge. So that's really nice. And then a, another hit for six. Is this actually, is this one of the. Oh, I don't know why. I was just sure that was a. Uh, I was just sure that was a scam one for some reason. Um, oh, there you go. It's because uh, limited edition card, is it? That's the only reason I got confused because I just familiarised myself uh, with the names, not anything else. But there you go. 85 bowling and 86 batting. What a card to use if you are uh, someone that plays the game. Last pack. Can we at least get uh, you know, a different variant of foil? Um, that would be really, really nice. So starting off with a Captain Fantastic again, Jos Butler, really nice five stars. Uh, Rasu, do uh, apologise about some of my pronunciation. Abil Rashid, 87 bowling, fantastic card there. Joe Clark. And then uh, we have a super booster, Lauren Bell, with an Adam Rossington and a Marta Carr. Hannah Jones and our two inserts. This looks a bit more promising. For maybe a different insert we'll soon see so we've got a gone for four cap and we just got the base card for and just the opposite way around this time there you go that stuff happens and uh yeah so three of the uh logos there obviously in my opinion never been the uh most exciting cards but you know they're still needed to complete the collection at the end of the day so if we finish off with this limited edition pack which uh yeah, it's just giving you the same uh, same odds. But I see it's, you know, the odds are not correct. So, are these four limited edition random? I don't know. We'll soon see. So, we've got Meg Lanning, uh, Danielle Gibson. We've got a couple cards turned around here, which I can only imagine aren't limited edition. So, maybe shinies. We'll just do them. No, nope, just base cards. Very weird. Uh, Ishmael and uh, Davidson Richards. Then we've got Adam Zampa. New signing Joe uh, Weverly. And here's our limited editions. We have a gold limited edition Megan Shutt. 95, uh, 94 bowling, sorry. So a really, really nice start. Yeah, by the looks of the front cover I'm looking at, these do seem to be the set limited editions in each game pack. But there you go, Jason Roy, 92 batting. Then we move on to Tammy Bermont, uh, Diamond Limited Edition, our first one of those. Um, so really nice, 93 batting there, 6 star. And then we finish off on our very last one, which is Andrew Russell. 90 bowling, 94 batting, diamond limited edition, absolutely a gorgeous card there, if I say so myself. So just that very quick recap on the limited editions. Um, I thought they were the same because in everyone, because you see here we've got uh, we've got Jason on the top there. Um, I think we got uh, I think. Uh, Vermont, no she's not, so yeah, it looks like it is actually just completely random possibly, um, maybe I could be wrong, I really, really don't know, um, but it, yeah, it does look like they're sort of perhaps very random in who you get, which is great because, you know, it's going to make people want to buy this more and get those limited editions, but nonetheless, four limited editions um, with any set you get is always impressive. Anyway, I'm going to end it there and stop my yapping. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed making it. Hopefully, I'm looking to do some sort of binder update and pack opening soon. Um, if you'd like to do that, you know, if you'd like me to do that, leave likes, all that good stuff. Subscribe if you're new. And um, until the next video, I'll see you guys around. Bye-bye.